Hello, and boy, are we excited to be here to start talking about reopening the J. It's been a quiet three months and we've missed everyone. As we prepare to welcome you back, we wanted to outline some changes that you'll see as you visit the Strom Jewish Community Center. In this new era of COVID-19, it is all of our responsibility to take care of our community. We wanted to spend a few minutes previewing the changes we're making here at the J to reduce the spread of COVID-19 in our community. So let's start at the beginning. During phases two and three, participation at the J will require you to sign an updated membership agreement. You will receive that agreement when you sign up for your first program back at the J. Please go through that process before you come visit. Now I turn it over to Josh Cross, who manages our fitness program, to talk about welcoming you back to the fitness center and to the pool here at the J. Hi, I'm Josh Cross, and I'm really excited to welcome you all back to the J as we begin reopening small group fitness classes, personal training, and lap swim, I want to share a few new practices and protocols we've put in place to help reduce the spread of COVID-19 in our community. Who is ready to sweat? We are. And to help you remember these new fitness protocols, we want you to think of the acronym SWEAT, which stands for schedule, workouts, every time, assess your health, and take care of the community. Following the state's safe start guidelines, fitness classes and lap lane capacity are temporarily limited and reservations are required for every visit. At the moment, the J is not open for drop-ins. We're using a system called Text My Spot, which is an easy way to help reserve your class or lap lane. For instructions, visit our welcome back page on sjcc.org. We've also started offering one-on-one -on -one personal training sessions again. If you're a current PT client, you can reach out to your trainer to set up a session. If you're new to personal training, send me an email at joshc at sjcc.org and I'll get you connected with one of our great trainers. Here's some things to remember when you come to work out. Please always do a self-assessment before heading to the J. If you do not feel 100%, please stay home and call your doctor. If you're feeling okay, come on over. Don't forget to sign your new waiver and membership agreement, which we'll send you after you book your first class or training session. Please bring your own towel and full water bottle because there won't be any towel service and water fountains are off limits. Come dress for your session. In the early stages of reopening, the locker rooms will be closed. Restrooms will be available at the bottom of the main staircase. When you arrive at the J, we'll do a quick health screening. We'll ask you a few health-related questions and take your temperature with a no-touch thermometer. A mask must be worn inside the J, including during workouts. It's one way we can all help take care of our community. While you're here, please follow all posted signs as entrances and guidelines may change. Looking ahead, we're hoping to reopen the fitness center and racquetball courts in phase three and the basketball gym in phase four. We'll share more specifics when we have them. Again, you can find all the latest information at sjcc.org slash welcome back. Thank you for your partnership in this. I'm excited to get back into my regular workout routines and I know you all are too. When we all do our part, we can help keep our community healthy and get back to the wonderful activities and people we've missed. Thank you and take care.